Today we are going to have an electric skateboard race here in Corona, California on a 100 year old racetrack. The winner gets $300. 300 bucks. Let's do it. Perfect. Before we start, you need to get educated. So I'm going to educate you. And I'm going to assume that you're like me and that your brain is fried from too much social media. So I'll keep it brief. Corona, California was founded in 1886. This guy showed up, dropped his card, and said, I can make a road that will make Corona stand out. So he did, that same year, 1886. 27 years later, they had a bunch of races on that road with $10,000 in prizes, but they stopped doing races when this guy crashed, killing himself and six other people. 105 years later, the owner of the Silver Dollar Pancake House invited me into his restaurant to prove to you guys that all of this is real. It's official, they had yeah. races out here. Yeah, years around, ago. around Grand Boulevard. Wow, that's it. Big that's circle. Grand Boulevard in 1949. What was your name? Robert. Robert. Robert cool. Hernandez, yeah. Thank you, Robert. All right, nice meeting you. I appreciate that. All right. Alrighty, boys, here's the rules. No running red lights, period, at all. First place gets 300 bucks. Have fun and be super safe. And you're allowed to throw the other person off their board. No, that's fine. No running red lights, <laughs> and we're going to hit it. Oh, rough housing is allowed. In all seriousness, the reason why I'm gonna win, I I can gun it. These guys just kind of like feather it just a little bit. And uh, yeah, I'm just balls to the wall. Well, I'm supposed to tell you why I'm gonna win? Because giving me an electric skateboard is like giving a cheetah a pair of inline roller skates. It's like giving a great white shark the fastest submarine in the Royal Navy fleet. So I actually thought I had lost this race from the very start. Something was wrong with my skateboard. I realized that the other person who had the skateboard had it in low power mode, but luckily everybody was at a red light. So I just caught up and the race really just started at this first red light. This is the real start. We're waiting for this. I realized I was probably the only person that had a chance to beat Josh, so I couldn't hesitate. I had to go all out, and I started getting some speed wobbles, which is a little bit scary. Nick stayed close behind us. He stayed relatively close the whole time, but once we got out of the tunnel, I realized I was in first, just giving the favorite a run for his money. Getting a phone call. Hello? It's a bad time. I'm going 15 on a skateboard. Maybe I should go faster. Oh, again, my God. I've almost eaten it four times, bro. These red lights are hilarious. We're just stopping right next to each other the whole race. Let's go. <laughs> who, who do you think's gonna win? Uh, Hi, you. This guy? Yes. I'm literally gonna do the Naruto. Dang it! You're so fast! Josh and I hit yet another red light. There's like 42 intersections. We did pretty good. We didn't hit all of them, but he made a fatal mistake on this red light. He hung out behind this car, and then he finally got set up next to me at the light, but by the time he got there, he wasn't quite ready on, when the light turned ball, green. Ball. Let's go! I got a huge lead on Josh and I enjoyed that for the next quarter mile and I was celebrating, putting my hands in the air. I was getting real cocky. Celebrating early, I know I'm gonna win. And then the traffic light in front of me was turning yellow, but I thought early. I could make it. This turns yellow now, he'll be able to make it through, but I definitely will not be able to. Oh my God, yeah, he's fucking going through. Exactly, I fucking called it. Holy oh. shit. I ran around, I did it. I ran around. I ran the red, I'm gonna wait. 
Dude, he stopped. He waited for me. No freaking way. <laughs> Get on your board, bro. What are you doing? guy in the YouTube video where we just keep cutting back to him. He's too scared to go fast. I got to shake my ass and I get to ride an electric skateboard. This is a pretty sick day. Let's see, it's about to turn green. Yo, Jackson is legit waiting for me. This is crazy. He wants it to be a fair race. Jackson, you better be ready, bro. It's about to turn green. I know, I'm ready. You ready? I was pulling up to the last traffic light and it was green and I could taste victory and I was right there and then it turns yellow. And so I slammed on my brakes and it threw me out in the middle of the road. So I came back to the red light. We had about 200 yards to finish the race. So whoever got the best start on this last red light will win the race. As you can see, my skateboard got put into reverse. Josh took off and won the race. Oh my God, I'm literally, I, I think I'm gonna win. What do I, do I, do I feel right about this? It's fair game. That's why the red lights were there. They were a challenge for all of us. Josh made some mistakes, I made some mistakes, and good on him. He won, you know, the first race. First place goes to Josh, $300. A kitchen set from Bubba Gum Shrimp Company <laughs> going to Nicholas oh Neal. The Jackson Street Bubba Gum memorabilia. It's a fuzzy shrimp neck for all of you. Oh. Do I get anything else? <laughs> no. Like and subscribe if you guys liked the video. I'm giving a giveaway at 1,000 subscribers. It is an awesome skateboard linked here. I love you guys. Thanks for watching.